guys on this video I want to show you the Holy Stone GPS AVP RC drone HS100 with camera live video and GPS return home quad quarter with adjustable wide angle 720p HD Wi-Fi camera this drone is uh, compatible with iPhone and Android devices it to hold intelligent follow me and battery loans control wrench the actual drone includes the extra propels and protectors and the base stand with screwdrivers a USB with some manuals the manual actually and a notebook from Holiston the USB micro so you could go ahead and charge your device the only thing that I didn't see on this actual drone is a uh, actually outlet to connect that USB so you may have to get only the USB cable is with it you guys could see here the actual drone the Holiston HS100 with a 720p camera and a base standing for the drone with four propels and protectors those protectors are very good because in that way if you hit that wall or something you know won't damage the propels the actual cost of this drone is about three hundred dollars a little bit less than that the flight time is up to 15 minutes you can see around the drone how nice look that's the battery right there has a uh, four LEDs we could take out the battery by pressing down and inside here we could see the terminal for the battery and the interior where the battery is located let me show you this battery around for you guys to see how how big it is and how it looks in here we could locate the micro USB port where you charge the drone you connect the cable right there and then you should be able to charge it that's the USB cable that goes there now we have the remote control from Holliston and we could put the phone right there on that actual stand I'm showing you the right on the left side of the actual controller the back side of it for you to guys have a better idea how it looks and under two where you charge the actual controller with the USB it's only a one USB included with it all right on my case I'm using an iPhone phone go to the App Store and download the application HS GPS Pro of course it's the same application for Android devices so the only thing that you have to do in Samsung would be to go to the Play Store with the name of the application and download it make sure the the actual creator is seeing the CN so in here we have the application open you go to enter device you allow it and now it's time for the drone to turn it on you have to follow the instructions that the screens give you and another thing that you have to do goes to the settings go to Wi-Fi and look for the Holy Stone FPV and connect to it after that go back to the application enter the device and you should be able to see the actual camera in this section you could go ahead and turn on the controller and you have to follow the instructions for the phone that will give you in here the instruction says that you have to pick up the aircraft and turn it horizontally the red and blue lights are always on the knee on the rear now when turning around counterclockwise clockwise after that procedure you have to go ahead and nose the heads up horizontal turn front red and white lamp constant calibration success now when turning around counterclockwise so this is the way that you have to do it you have to flip the drone and rotate it as a clock wise direction and then once the lights are solid you have to go ahead and flip it over and put it in the right direction on the floor this section we could go to the main menu in here we could select the flight altitude the flight distance the return altitude and we have the beginner mode right here you want to activate it and then press save in here we have different option to go back to the main application 
this one is to show off the, the menu for the home or follow the people the takeoff and the landing and here we have the camera and the video filming so beside that we have uh, the other option right here that is to rotate the camera upside down in here we have a PR option if we want to use a VR in here we see our pre-recordings like we take a picture right now or we take a video right here it says recording we stop it the same way and then we go here and we can find photos and videos right here besides that we have in here the flight record the date distance speed and altitude in here we have our the GPS signal you know of right now inside here uh, I don't get any GPS signal and outside is raining right now so I kind of show you with the with the GPS you know but in here we show the satellites here we have the actual remote for the drone and we put an iPhone in there so most likely to turn around you go right here and here you have different options to return home to take off and landing of course the joystick you can see the model number right here and the manufacturer we have to follow the person like the compass in there and the speed of the actual drone this will be the left side of the actual remote in the right side of the remote we have the angle and then we have the camera and the video filming option just to press it down now let me show you guys the actual drone going out from the actual building and it's kind of pretty hard at the beginning to control it but once you get hands to it it will be easier for you so that's why I'm trying you know to control it at the beginning and you have different options like beginner mode and full mode you know like regular mode where you control the altitude and the balance of the drone and everything so it's quite different between the DJI, the actual DJI is kind of like easier but for the price different you know it's a lot of practice that you have to take on this one so you could handle it better I'm not a professional you know drone pilot but I'm trying to improve my skills on this one the speed of the actual drone is very nice, it's very stable just take some practice you know I fully uh, recommend this drone for the price you could get it by in Amazon for two hundred seventy nine point ninety nine. Some sellers, you know, they charge taxes. Some of them they don't. So it's a pretty accurate drone. The camera to take pictures, you no know, bow or videos. Of course, for the price, you won't get a four K camera or something like that. But it's not bad for the price. looks tiny So the left stick is to move it either up or down or you can move it left or right which rotates the drone, it spins it around. If you use the right stick it's going to make it go left or right or forwards or backwards. So, so you push the that button the second to the last to get take off and to land it you take it closer to the ground and you push the last button see it automatically lands you the actual drone that is charging and the remote controller it is charging too you should see a red light 
when it's plugged into the power, 